<laughs> Hello, this is Patrick Hodgins, Senior Director of Health, Safety, Security, Environmental for Buckeye Partners. We are the owner and operator of Wood River Pipeline, located in Kankakee, Illinois. I'd like to take this time to give an update on the situation that has occurred off of Route 113 involving our pipeline. On Friday morning, we were informed of a potential gasoline release along Route 113 in Kankakee County. Upon arrival at the site, uh, gasoline uh, diesel mixture was visibly uh, in the ditches along the uh, route. We immediately shut down all lines in the area and responded with contractors to mitigate the incident as quickly as possible with the local, state, and federal agencies. Currently, crews are working 24-7 around the clock to mitigate this incident as quickly and safely as possible. Safety of the public is our number one priority, and as such, we have set up air monitoring around the vicinity of the release as well as the outlying uh, residences near the release site. To date, we have had no unsafe levels of exposure for residents to be concerned with. We are very um, concerned about the safety of the residents and ensuring that they get proper information. In addition, we have been testing water wells for those residents in the vicinity of the release, and to date, those results have come back as non-detect. We will continue to test those water wells until f further notice. In addition, for those on water wells, we will continue to provide bottled water to their homes. That started yesterday afternoon on Friday, and we will continue to do so until further notice. In addition, we are re-looking at the potential release uh, area. It initially was reported to be 500 gallons. With indications from the field and from the local response agencies, it is possible that the release took place as early as Wednesday when a power line uh, was reportedly re uh, down on the ground arcing near the pipeline right away. Therefore, the potential worst case scenario for gasoline to be released is somewhere in the area of 25 to 35 barrels. That needs to be further confirmed with field activity and recovery. But at that rough estimate, it would be somewhere in the area of 1,000 gallons. At this time, there's been no injuries or fires reported. Wood River Spill Management Team is coordinating with the local fire emergency response officials and relevant state and federal agencies to mitigate this as quickly as possible with safety being priority number one. If you have any questions or concerns, we have issued a claim center, and the phone number is 866-601-5880. Again, a claim center hotline is 866-601-5880. It is manned 24 hours a day, seven days a week. If you feel you have any claims as a result of this incident, please feel free to call there at that toll-free number. In addition, we have a website that will be up and running within the afternoon of Saturday, www.kankakeeroute113release.com. Again, that's www.kankakeeroute113 release.com. We will continue to keep that website up and running until further notice to give residents a quick access to information on what's taking place. It's an unfortunate we had this release. Uh, the incident uh, cause will be under further investigation. In the meantime, the priority is the safety of the public, safety of the responders, and to mitigate the incident as quickly as possible. We also like to confirm there has been no sheen witness on the Kinkakee River. We will continue to monitor that river throughout the day, every day, until we feel uh, it's necessary. In addition, there's been no sheen witnessed anywhere within the creek leading to the outfall of the river. We have 31 locations from the release site through the ditches along the roadways into the tributaries to prevent any sheen of any kind entering the river. That will continue to be a priority on the environmental side to ensure minimize the impact. And finally, we'd like to thank the assistance of the local fire department from Kankakee, the police department, the Limestone Fire Protection District, the Kankakee County Emergency Management Agency and their personnel, the county health department, the sheriff's office, as well as the Illinois Environmental Protection Agency and the United States Environmental Protection Agency. Their assistance has been greatly appreciated and very critical in mitigating this incident as quickly as possible.
we have an incident command structure in place, and we have unified command uh, headquartered here in Kankakee as a joint response to this unfortunate accidental release of gasoline mixture into the uh, roadside ditch. Thank you for your time. You can reach me, Patrick Hodgins, at 832-215-7877 with any further questions.